Right. <clears throat> Time for a very boring game. Very boring. Super boring. <laughs> Unbelievably boring. Because I'll let the intro play again first. Which is gonna take forever. Pastime sports for financial manipulation. Evil Lord Harkin has amassed an arsenal of warrior robots and seeks an empire of terror. Infamous for crime, the Baron has invested his fortune in the sport. He's plotting to take the capital. By winning the local tournaments, Harkin can consolidate his power and destroy all opposition. Now the Baron controls most of the robots and has bribed those remaining to ensure victory. <clears throat> within the city lies within the city lies the pieces of a super robot that create a virtual indestructible robot. <laughs> Seriously, that sentence makes no sense. Uh, it could terrorize the city. A race to find it is about to begin. For he who has it will take the capital. The guild, the city managers, have uncovered the plot. They risk being destroyed by the Baron's power. It's too late to stop the tournaments. Only a surprise outsider could change the situation. That outsider is you. I don't know if there's... I'm not hearing sounds. Oh, there it is. Is it coming through on the capture? Do you hear the music, PLD? Oh yeah, no, no, it's working. Never mind. Uh, yeah. Anyways, boring game. Very, very boring game. So, the difference between these things is um, the game itself doesn't get more difficult. Um, you just have like better equipment from the start, and uh, it's it, pff, I would recommend just playing easy. You can buy new upgrades, but. Uh, the problem is that you don't get a lot of credits unless you just completely destroy a robot, which is very much impossible to do, otherwise you only get two credits um, for taking down both arms and the body, which I'm gonna do. Um, also, I'll explain it when I have enough credits to upgrade, because the upgrade system is the credit system is actually very dumb. Also enjoy this track because that's the only thing you're gonna hear. Uh, once I start an actual battle it's just me 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 me. Oh, uh, yeah. Smart. Thought there was something wrong. So all you do is stand still and kill their arms.
If you walk into them while doing this, you get hurt yourself, so... Best to do this so you don't get hurt. And now you have to destroy the body, and the fun part about that is you have to punch upwards. But if you're at the b bottom level, you go up. And they keep... See what they're doing? It's so miserable. <laughs> Oh, I'm killing his... Oh, wait. That would be good if he's... Oh. I don't know how much credits you get if you destroy them completely. But yeah, it's... It's just hard to kill them because they keep running away once their arms are destroyed. And you can't punch upwards on the bot. Well, you can, but you have to like lock in and then push up. And then they just walk away again, so... This is... this is really horrible. And there's nothing hard about it, about the game. Um... Oh, come on, dude. Come on. There we go. Jesus. But yeah, that's the entire game. That's all you need to do. And sometimes you heal between levels and sometimes you don't and I don't know why. Like nothing changes in this game. They get, like, stronger robots that damage you more, but that's about it. And it's like 16 normal robots, 4 boss robots, and then the final boss robots. <laughs> it's just not a fun game. You know, we're, we're doing this fucking man's again. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Oh, come on, dude. One hit. Oh, there we go. Alright, so now I can improve. You can see that I only have four credits. And, uh, like... It says price 18. But it means, like, the one I have now is 14, and this one is 18, so it's 4 credits. Makes no sense, but... But yeah, I, I upgraded one of my weapons now. And now we're playing the dodge game again. It's so dumb, dude. Now one of his arms is still alive, apparently. Although he does not have any energy left. Oh, come on, 
a one hit. Timer, Jesus. Well, just that five minutes or something at the end. Yeah, this is one of the more expensive games on Game Boy. I don't think it's sold well, I guess. Or they just didn't make many, I don't know. This is so dumb, dude. Right, that was like stage one, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if you, if you want to call it that. Do you think I now have enough for my body? Yeah. So this is the biggest, well, the best body you can get. And now you do a little side-scrolling thingy. I don't even know what the points are for because you always get the same amount at the end anyway. Only the missiles can hit you from the tanks, not the actual tanks itself. I don't understand why they didn't put, like, music in the levels. Were they so happy with the robot sounds they made on Game Boy? Ah, oh, boss time. Same deal. <laughs> you just stand still and hit him until his arms are gone and you hope he doesn't hit you too much which sometimes happens during these boss fights like what is happening right now and now we play the dancing game again
I guess that was the first boss. <laughs> Got some more credits, so can improve some stuff. And now we're back to this. Thank you, Lord Shadowcaster, for the host. There's something wrong with the uh, Streamlabs thingies. Either they don't show up or, or they get stuck. We'll have to take a look at that. Oh, I got him. Oh. oh, come on, I almost had you. There. Sometimes the AI is dumb enough. Mm, can I improve another thing? Yes. Yes, all I'm doing is spamming A and B. Alright, here we go again. No, go back. Can also hold them down, by the way. <clears throat> but that doesn't work when they're when they still have their arms. Can I? Yeah. I think. Yeah, that's the best legs as well. Oh, he's down. I didn't see it. No. No. I know, very, very, very exciting game. At least it's beatable easier. Can never complain about that. No. No. Get 
over there. No. 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 Back. No. Uh. No. I think I can improve some more stuff. Uh, sure. I need one more for that. Oh, back to this part already. Game has an interesting idea. Sadly, it, it it's it's just boring. Once you figure out how to beat everything, and everything is exactly the same, so sometimes you just have to get lucky, and you don't get hit too much. But that's about it, actually. There are continues, but I don't know how they work. Sometimes you have one, sometimes you have three. Maybe it's the amount of credits you still have left or something, I don't know. I'll try and do it without a game over. Although it depends if they heal me between battles or not. Which is a very weird thing that sometimes doesn't happen. There's also a, a sheet code for special mode. And I have no idea what that does. <laughs> no idea. The code works and you get like the... The thingy, but it doesn't seem to do anything. Alright, now a second boss. Alright. Back in your corner. No! Nope. Said back in your corner, not up. <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> oh, that is AI. No, come on, dude. Back, go back. This is so annoying. There. How many upgrades more? Oh, I'm two more upgrades and I'm done actually. And then I have full power.
those points at the top only matter if you run out of time, then the guy with the most points wins. In case you were wondering what that is for. <sighs> I hate this so much. Still healing me between. I have no idea what causes you to not heal between levels. I, d I really don't understand. <laughs> this is so dumb, dude. again and now we're back to this bullshit please stay there please no never that lucky huh come on come on back no no Why was I ducking? I have no idea. Dude! Stop it. Stop it. I'll die. There we go, Jesus. Alright. There. Fully upgraded. This might actually be the final stage already? No, I don't remember. I think it is actually. I think you only need three parts.
Mm. No, no, you need four. Like both arms, legs, and torso. Jesus, dude. Okay. <sighs> yeah, still four more. Well, five more of these. Ugh. <laughs> Yes, yay, yay, I'm so happy I get to play this marvelous game. <sighs> Glad I have a copy of it before it gets even more expensive, but what a boring, boring game. I can't even say it's bad, it's just boring. Sub JC. I guess you already played this. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, you fucking asshole. Sure it is. Best game ever. I guess it's a game everybody can beat. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Can't say much more about this game. Thanks for the hose, JC. Seriously, there's something wrong with those. 
what you call it, alerts. I'll have to look into that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like 700 games away. Get. Oh, I almost wrecked him completely. Come on, dude. Five hundred and one. I think I just hit the three hundred mark. Which is also not bad. I don't ever see me owning a complete set though. Unless I win the lottery or something. Some of those games are too expensive. Like Zass. I can't afford that game. $125. Yeah, that's still not even close to the same category that, uh... Hey, dude, what the fuck is happening? Well, I'm wrecked. I have no idea what just happened there. Zaz is its own category, dude. Yeah, Zass. He's at AS. It's a Japanese only shoot him up. It's literally unaffordable. Yeah, that's that's very weird though. I I wonder why because like they even uh, sold those here. Honestly, a lot of game stores had had just U.S. copies selling them. Like a lot of my games that I had. Since I was a kid, are like U.S. copies. While I just bought them in a in a game store here. <clears throat> yeah, I checked if which ones I had. Otherwise, I would have traded them or something with you. But I. Uh, I have European versions of those games.
<clears throat> Congratulations, you are the winner of the tournament. You have found all the pieces of the super robot and you have thwarted the Baron's plans to construct a super robot that would terrorize the city, allowing the Baron to take control of the capital. The crowd wishes to thank you for defending them from the imperialistic Baron and saving the city. Not yet. It's false ending. <laughs> but you discovered that these pieces are only cheap imitations. The Baron managed to grab all the pieces long before you did. The guardians placed around the duplicate pieces were put there to throw you off of the track and help disguise the Baron's movements. The Baron says that he shouldn't have any trouble reducing you to a mount of bubble. Rubble. My apologies. And he is surprised that you managed to get as far as you did. Get ready for the ultimate fight. Which is the same fight as any other fight in the game. But if you're a little bit unlucky like what happened with the previous boss, you get wrecked immediately. So let's see what happens. Come on, dude. Be scared. This is gonna be close. Come on, dude. My Wily's Revenge run? That's not even a good run. Ah, he got me, motherfucker. Thank you, I guess. <laughs> you should probably have to check out the other runners though. They're a lot better than me. Oh yeah, it's good for that, for sure. <laughs> Still uses a lot of the old strats as well. Dude, stop! Yeah, there is a tutorial video as well. Okay, I'm in a better position this time. The 
thank you for the follow when I was offline, by the way. Alright, he's down. It's over. last piece of the Baron's army has been destroyed, so has his plan for conquest. The Baron is gone, and peace once again returns to the Urton capital. You are now the Metal Master, Defender of Earth and Guardian of the Guilds. Congratulations! Your efforts will be rewarded and your bravery and honor unequaled. That is, until another War Baron rises again. <sighs> so, 40 minutes for this game, give or take. Uh, raffle is open, so say something in chat if you want to pick the next game. Um, everything besides puzzle game and RPG are open for picks. No. Choose whatever you want. I will not be able to play it anymore today, I'm afraid. I will check it out real quick, especially if it's a Japanese game, if I can even play it. 